Hello and welcome. This is Jessica Loper here to offer you intuitive guidance and help you to stay in the flow and on track with your goals. So I'm going to be super honest with you. I'm not really feeling super on track today. <laughs> it's kind of one of those days where like I have felt unsettled. Um, and I've noticed this past week something that's coming up a lot for me is just noticing a lot of these phrases that we often hear, I'm sure you're familiar with most of them, um, like this too shall pass or a blessing in disguise, look for the silver lining, um, a delay is in your best interest, rejection is protection. <laughs> I've had a lot of these, like last week was just one of those weeks where I was feeling kind of delayed or off track um kind of did come into this space of peace and 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 knowing and trust right um but then I got to today and I'm just kind of like unsettled not in a bad way it's almost like I just haven't taken the time that I need to really ground and reflect um I am feeling behind I'm recording this in the afternoon I normally record and have it uploaded in the morning right and I had that thought like oh maybe I'll just do it tomorrow and I was like, no, I'm, I'm like, I'm really committed to doing my best to get this out every other Monday. So I'll do it right now, even though it's not my preferred time. Um, you know, it's okay. So I guess in a way that is my way of going with the flow today is just being able to adapt and do it when the time came instead of when I had planned because I got pulled away to other things, right? But anyway, back to um, all these sayings that have been coming up for me this past week, and they're all good. They're good mindset tools. They have helped me over the years, over the years. Um, this too shall pass is a big one that has helped me. And also, um, a delay is in your best interest. Oftentimes it is, right? But how often do we get a delay and we just feel like maybe we're doing something wrong or it's not meant to be or we just feel frustrated or angry? And what I was reminded last week was that you can mentally think of these these phrases and use them to help you in a mindset sense, but also to feel what's needed. Like don't use them to bypass what you're feeling. That's what I'm getting at. And I, that was like the aha moment for me last week is because I think in the past, sometimes I have used them to just kind of bypass what I'm feeling. Um, and it's totally possible to do both. They're both important. The mind is important, important and feeling our feelings is also important. Um, they both have purpose and I think they're so much more powerful when you can use them together. So for the example of a delay is in your best interest, you know, maybe you just say that, right? And that's kind of what I did. I just said, you know what? I know this delay is in my best interest. I know that there is a whole universe, God, divine team, whatever it is behind me that knows a lot more than I do, that can see far out and can see the big picture a lot more than I can. Um, so, you know, Mentally, I can say, okay, yeah, I'm going to trust. I know that the delay's in the best interest. I do. I know that. And I can stay positive. Yet, also, I am noticing that I feel disappointed and discouraged. And you know what? I'm just going to let myself feel that. And that's what I do. And a little trick I use for myself is I kind of put a time frame on it. And you don't have to do this. It may or not work for you. But it's just a trick that's helped me is to say, I'm going to let myself feel disappointed today. And just like really like feel that in your heart space or whatever space comes to you with listening to your body. And I am super jittery today. I know. <laughs> um, and I didn't even have that much coffee. I really didn't. I had one cup. <laughs> so, and that was hours and hours ago. Anyway, um... Yeah, can you just give yourself permission? And oftentimes I've found that I, without even trying or thinking about it, uh, giving myself that space and permission to feel the feeling um, really does help me to just hold space for myself 
um, while also like knowing in the back of my mind, like, it's going to be okay. <laughs> it's okay to feel this way. I know it's going to be okay, but you know what? I'm going to feel this. And usually if I just tell myself I'm going to feel this for today, usually before the day's over or by the next day, I've totally shifted into something else, you know, but it's not forced, you know, it just na happens naturally. So, um, that's just my tip for today. I'm going to keep it short, so have a good couple of weeks and I will be back.